A flash file system is a file system designed for storing files on flash memory or Euro based storage devices. While the flash file systems are closely related to file systems in general, they are optimized for the nature and characteristics of flash memory, and for use in particular operating systems. Overview While a block device layer can emulate a disk drive so that a general purpose file system can be used on a flash based storage device. This is suboptimal for several reasons, erasing blocks, flash memory blocks have to be explicitly erased before they can be written to. The time taken to erase blocks can be significant, thus it is beneficial to erase unused blocks while the device is idle. Random access, general purpose file systems are optimized to avoid disk seeks whenever possible, due to the high cost of seeking. Flash memory devices impose no seek latency. We're leveling. Flash memory devices tend to wear out when a single block is repeatedly overwritten. Flash file systems are designed to spread out writes evenly. Log structured file systems have all the desirable properties for a flash file system. Such file systems include JFFS2 and YAFFS. Because of the particular characteristics of flash memory, it is best used with either a controller to perform wear leveling and error correction or specifically designed flash file systems which spread writes over the media and deal with the long erase times of NAND flash blocks. The basic concept behind flash file systems is, when the flash store is to be updated, the file system will write a new copy of the changed data over to a fresh block, remap the file pointers, then erase the old block later when it has time. In practice, flash file systems are only used for memory technology devices, which are embedded flash memories that do not have a controller. Removable flash memory cards and USB flash drives have built in controllers to manage MTD with dedicated algorithms, like wear leveling, bad block recovery, power loss recovery, garbage collection, and error correction, so use of a flash file system has limited benefit. Flash based memory devices are becoming more prevalent as the number of mobile devices is increasing, the cost per memory size decreases, and the capacity of flash memory chips increases. Origins, the earliest flash file system, managing an array of flashes a freely writable disk, was true FFS by M Systems of Israel, presented as a software product in PC Card Expo, Santa Clara, California, July 1992 and patented in 1993. One of the earliest flash file systems was Microsoft's FFS2, for use with MS-DOS, released in autumn 1992. FFS2 was preceded by an earlier product, called FFS, which however fell short of being a flash file system, managing a flash array as worm space rather than as a freely writable disk. Around 1994, the PCMCIA, an industry group, approved the flash translation layer specification, based on the design of M Systems True FFS. The specification was authored and jointly proposed by M Systems and SCM Microsystems, who also provided the first working implementations of FTL. Endorsed by Intel and other industry leaders, FTL became a popular flash file system design in non PCMCIA media as well. Linux flash file systems, JFFS, JFFS2, and YAFFS. JFFS was the first flash specific file system for Linux, but it was quickly superseded by JFFS2, originally developed for NOR Flash. Then YAFFS was released in 2002, dealing specifically with NAND Flash, and JFFS2 was updated to support NAND Flash 2. UBIFS, UBIFS has been merged since Linux 2.6.22 in 2008. UBIFS has been actively developed from its initial merge. UBIFS's documentation hosted at infradeed.org along with JFFS2 and MTD drivers. Some initial comparisons show UBIFS with compression faster than F2FS. LogFS, LogFS, another Linux Flash-specific file system, is currently being developed to address the scalability issues of JFFS2. F2FS. F2FS was added to the Linux kernel 3.8. Instead of being targeted at speaking directly to raw flash devices, F2FS is designed to be used on flash-based storage devices that already include a flash translation layer, 
such as SD cards. Overlay PSOFs, these are union file systems, that allow multiple file systems to be combined and presented to the user as a single tree. This allows the system designer to place parts of the operating system that are nominally read only on different media to the normal read write areas. OpenWRT is usually installed on raw flash chips without FTL. It uses overlays to combine a compressed read only squash FS with JFFS2. Translation layers Some subsystems are often called flash file systems, while they are more precisely block drivers performing different translations, and they actually do not have a file system interface. Such subsystems include the following equals true FFS equals Despite the name, TrueFFS is not a file system at all. It does not provide a file system interface but a disk interface. TrueFFS is correctly termed a flash translation layer. True flash file system or TrueFFS is designed to run on a raw solid state drive. TrueFFS implements error correction, bad block remapping and wear leveling. Externally, TrueFFS presents a normal hard disk interface. TrueFFS was created by M Systems on well-known Disk on Chip 2000 product line, who were acquired by SanDisk in 2006. A derivative of TrueFFS, called TFFS or TFFS Lite, is found in the VXWorks operating system, where it functions as a flash translation layer, not as a fully functional file system. A flash translation layer is used to adapt a fully functional file system to the constraints and restrictions imposed by flash memory devices. Equals Extreme FFS equals, Extreme FFS is a technology being developed by SanDisk allowing for improved random write performance and flash memory compared to traditional systems such as TrueFFS. SanDisk claims that the technology improves random access speed in solid state drives by a factor of 100. The company plans on using Extreme FFS in an upcoming multi-level cell implementation of NAND flash memory. See also, list of flash file systems, we're leveling, write amplification. References External links, presentation on various flash file systems, 92007, article regarding various flash file systems, 2005 Uzenix Annual Conference, Survey of Various Flash File Systems, 82005, Anatomy of Linux Flash File Systems, 52008.